painting is by Guy Pen de Bois, and he was an artist that my mom and dad knew, and he gave this to them for a wedding present in 1945. It's hung on the wall in our family home my whole childhood, and I looked at her every day, and they told me her name was Stephanie. And do you know where the name came from? I do not. I don't know anything about her. Well, he's quite a fascinating character. He's known as an art critic as well, and his father was an art critic. And he studied with some of the most important painters of the time in America. He studied under William Merritt Chase, and then he followed that up. Among others, he studied with Henry. And I think that's where the sort of social realist aspect of his work comes to play. He spent six years in Paris, and in 1930, he came back to the States. And I think that this work is certainly after that time frame. Now, how close it was executed before it was gifted, I, I couldn't say for sure. The work is oil on paper, which is why you're seeing the sheet buckling in the surface of that. It is oil. It is oil, but it's on I paper, so that that heavy pigment on that is what's causing that rippling mm -hmm. look in the surface. Mm -hmm. And can you tell us a little bit about this photograph? Well, all I really know about the photograph is that this lady playing the piano is my mother. Mm -hmm. And I don't know who the other two people are in the photo, but I had a suspicion that that man in the back there may have been Guy de Bois. I think you're exactly correct. It is Guy de Bois. And this all adds to the, the provenance and the story behind the picture. So the, the photograph is a fascinating part of what we're talking about. It in and of itself doesn't have a lot of value, but it should stay with the painting. It adds to the value of the painting. At auction right now, 2014, I would set the value at six to $8,000. Oh, nice. Great, thank you.